like I just woke up because I did. Let's just get this started. I don't even think I have anything to say. Mm, that's a lie. I always have something to say. What in the frick? I'm looking at the road, mom. Don't worry. We need to fix this. Let me just put my blank. Okay, what? I need to sneeze. Just kidding. Go ahead. Yeah, you're gonna go anyway, I know. Okay, what's going on? What's going on? I never say that. Hey guys, it's Gianna. Welcome back to my channel. Welcome if you're new here. I thought I told myself I stopped saying that like four months ago. Today, we're gonna answer some questions that I'm too afraid to ask or whatever the title of this video is. I really don't remember. I'm going on a drive because I think it's boring to film it in my room. This road is really bumpy. So I don't really know this angle, this lighting. My hair is all greasy. I put on these cute earrings because I thought it made me look a little better. I had to re-pierce my hole for that. It really hurt. I don't know what the goal of this video is. I don't know what I'm doing. I don't know where I'm going, but I should probably actually pull over and find some questions. I think I asked you guys questions like a week ago on Instagram. Go follow that if you are not following it already. Please follow me on Instagram. I'm tired of asking nicely. Just kidding. I'm joking. I'm totally kidding. Do what you want with your life. Be who you want to be. Why is this turning into a motivational speech? I'm all over the place. If this is, okay, let me just rant for a second. I thought I was already ranting. We're gonna continue the rant. I don't care what people think about me. As we know, that's one of the biggest things that I like to show on my channel is that you don't need to care about what people think. I almost just hit a bird. You don't need to care about what, but, you don't need to care about what people think about you. It's just unnecessary. And I know it's like way easier said than done. Like way, 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 way easier said than done. But I, to be honest, woke up about 15 minutes ago. Um, did shampoo, no, dry shampoo. I dry shampooed my hair, which I never do because I don't care if it's greasy. I brushed it, I put on some earrings and I was gonna do makeup, but I was like, I don't want to put on makeup when I don't normally wear makeup just so that the people first time clicking on my channel that was worded terribly just so that people who are clicking on my channel for the first time think i'm somewhat put together because if you know me if you've been subscribed for a while you know that i'm never put together but i always seem to get my stuff done i'm about to get hit like three ways fun fact i can't park for my life i used to be good at parking until about like what two weeks ago and then i figured out that i never make it in between the lines my ted talk is over Amaya, uh, I'm not answering that. Okay, I posted on my Instagram story to give me questions I'm too afraid to answer. Um, I have a question. When can I tell the MacPack? Okay, thank you. Because, because here's the deal. Okay, so I didn't really get an answer, but I guess the answer is not today. Anyways, big things coming soon to say the least. Only about, only a couple of my friends know about this. So I'm not gonna be able to say anything until further notice. Let's start off easy with, are you excited for senior year? Yes. Yes, I am. I'm very excited for senior year. It's going to be amazing. The next question is, do you like someone? Um, I wouldn't say like. I'm just gonna keep it simple and say no. There is nobody that I'm interested in. When's the last time you cried and why? I'm not the biggest crier, honestly. Like, I don't cry a lot. But when I do cry, a breakdown because I keep everything in my, I don't have the capacity. What? And when I feel like crying, it doesn't happen until one thing just explodes. So the last time I cried was December 28th. The reason I remember that is because that's the day I went to Arizona. It doesn't say in why. Oh, it does say in why. I cried over liking someone. That's why I cried. There's a lot of worst thing you've ever done. I think you're gonna have to check back in 10 years because I don't really have one. Worst thing I've ever done. Okay, seventh grade. I wrote a diss track on somebody I wasn't very fond of. Um, nobody really knows about that except for like some of my close friends. I've recently found it in my notes. It's actually like really, really, really mean. I seem to get along with everybody. I have a lot of people that don't like me but are too afraid to tell me they don't like me. Like I know, say it to my face, there's just, 10 people I could name. Honestly, I don't know why they hate me. I don't know why they have an issue with me. But does it bother me? No. No, it doesn't. Why wear super showy bikinis when we're supposed to dress modestly? And why almost always crop tops? Okay, I don't think this girl is trying to bash on me. Like, 
I mean, she could be like, I don't know her intentions, but I get a lot of questions on modesty as a Christian. Okay, I feel like this is a big thing in high school that a lot of girls who are Christians struggle with. I don't think that it matters on what you're wearing. I think it matters on your intentions when you're wearing it. So if you put on a crop top and you're like, I'm wearing this because my boobs look good and these boys are gonna look at them. I think that that's when it crosses the line because I don't do that. I don't wear tops to like show other people, show guys like, you know what I mean? Like I don't do that, I need to get over. I wear tops because it's my style, I think they're cute, like I like to take Instagram photos and show you guys my style and my outfits. Um, I wear what makes me feel confident. That can be literally what I'm wearing right now, sweatpants and a crew neck. I'll wear this to school, who cares? This lady was looking at me like, what is this girl doing? And then as far as bikinis go, I wear bikinis to my friend's house, to Maddie's house. We sit in her hot tub. And I don't really care because it's her family, like whatever. In public though, I try not to wear super cheeky things because I don't like when men look at my anything. I hate attention from males. Ask any of my friends, it gives me the duh. I don't know how to describe it. I just get so grossed out when a guy likes me. If I like them first and they like me back, that's a different story. But when I get attention from people that I don't want it from, it makes me very uncomfortable. That's the easiest way to put it. What are your plans after high school? This one is kind of TBD right now, just because there's a lot of different factors that go into it. I've never been a huge college person. I am a firm believer that you don't need to go to a super expensive college to be successful. So right now I'm thinking about taking a gap year to focus on my YouTube channel or going to community college. That's most likely gonna happen at community college and then transfer. Um, my dream school is Texas A&M. Will that ever happen? No. Have you ever thought about drinking or doing drugs or vaping? Yes. I have thought about it um, and I've never done it. I think vaping, I don't, I just don't understand it. Um, if you vape, you do you. I don't hate you. I'm not against vaping for you, whatever. But personally, I don't want to put that in my body. Drinking, I don't see a point to that either. Like, sure, get drunk with your friends one time in high school, whatever. But if you're getting drunk every weekend at parties and everything, I think that's where the line should be crossed. And smoking, that's a big no for me. Absolutely not. First kiss question mark. I've told this story on my YouTube channel plenty of times. Uh, my first kiss was my freshman year of high school with my freshman boyfriend. It was on homecoming on our friend's porch after homecoming. Do you like anyone right now that's been in your videos? No. Will you be friends with someone who isn't Christian? Yes. I do not care if you are Christian or not. I don't care what your beliefs are. I don't care who you are. I don't care what you identify as. I will still love and be your friend. No judgment. Have you ever almost lost your V card? <laughs> no. I have never been close. Um, I'm waiting till marriage. Purity ring. I think that a lot of people know that, maybe not. If you're new here, I'm waiting till marriage. I am a Christian, I've wanted to wait since I was little. It's my decision. So that's gonna be it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, give it a thumbs up and subscribe down below to become a part of the Mac Pack. I haven't done a Q&A in like three months, so I decided to do this little video. And I hope you guys enjoyed it or learned something new. I've hit literally every single yellow light today, I swear. <sighs> that's annoying. Okay, anyways, I love you guys so much and I will hopefully see you in the next one. Peace out, Mac Pack.